so hello guys in this video i'm going to show you how to connect your slack client app to your desktop app so what i mean is that uh, you won't have to be using the browser to log into slack and you can see the messages so i'm going to show you step by step how you'll be using the slack desktop app to receive notifications about alx and uh, your current and old classroom okay so what we do i'm assuming that i'm assuming that you have already created your intranet account and you have logged in so there are previous steps on how to do that so i'm assuming you did that okay so if you hadn't you can put down the comment section if you need assistance on that so what we can do you can see there's an email here about the room se team whereby you are supposed to click this link so i'm assuming you you have gotten this link so let me zoom in so that you can see so you can see this link is just saying hi bonface how are you doing have you successfully signed up for the internet your virtual classroom if not can you take a few minutes to review your email yesterday no pressure but you, you've got this so basically i'm showing you how to connect your slack and also how to use the slack on the desktop so stay put and follow along so as you can see here there are steps that you can use so the first step is to log in into your intranet account so that's the first step that's what you're going to do now so i'm going to click this link here you can see this link says login here So these links takes me into my account of the internet virtual classroom. So you might not have seen these, you might have been redirected to a login page whereby you log in to your internet account, then you'll come and see, you'll be redirected and see this page. So what you can do from here is that uh, on your bottom left part of your screen, you can see there is two icons here, the profile icon and the Slack icon. So what you're supposed to do is just click the Slack icon. So that's what I'm going to do. Click the Slack icon. So this one will open up Slack on my, this one will open up Slack on my browser. So I'm waiting for it to finish loading. So as you can see, I'm directed to my Slack classroom inside the browser. So what I'm about to show you is how to connect your Slack in, from the browser to using the desktop application. So what you are supposed to do, I'm assuming you have already installed Slack and if you haven't, here are some links that can help you to, so this is the link to, to install Slack on your Windows machine. Also, here's another link to install Slack on your MacBook. And also, you can check how to install Slack using your Ubuntu or Kali Linux. So you can search for Rapport there and you are good to go. We can continue the, this process. So you can see there's a download buttons, download for 64 bit. So you're going to go back to the browser, Slack in the browser. And as you can see in the top left corner of your screen, there is an ALX student title, which is a drop down with more more items. So you can click that. I guess you saw what I did there. You can click the ALX students. And then you can see there are many options here. But the option you're interested in is the open this lock up. So what you are supposed to do from here is that you should click on this link. So let me click on this link. So this link will redirect me and it will prompt me to ask me whether I'm allowing this website to open my Slack app. So I'm going to press open Slack. As you can see, my Slack app has loaded. So let, let, let me wait for it to load completely.
so as you can see i have different classrooms here i have the alx i have another one and another one another one so on your case you might have only the alx students but if you are enrolled on other classrooms then you have different classrooms for that so this is the alx students classroom so this is what you are interested on and you can see various options you can see the direct messages you can see the mentions you can see the drafts you can see the announcements which are made by the admins also you can see the community jams whereby people they are introducing themselves so you can see here this is uh, the community jams there is the review there is the general classroom so there is the general classroom you can see the cohort 12 so this is cohort 12 that's what we are in so yeah the announcements of cohort 12 announcements so it's pretty simple to connect those apps together. You can go to, if you are bored, you can go here to the Mimeology and you can see some memes and uh, you'll be having some fun with this one, getting a cool project idea. And then when you have halfway through, <laughs> you find something that you find that it isn't easy, but you have to do the hard, thing, the hard things the hard way so that's it guys so i hope this helped you and if it did click the subscribe button and uh, like and share this video so this is the first video for my youtube channel so yeah that's how you integrate your slack app and the browser slack so if you want to follow me along or maybe you have a question you can check my social media handles on the description below so if you need me to make a video maybe you didn't know how to create to change the password of the internet account how to log in the internet account you can post that in the comment section i'll come and see that later so have a good day guys Make sure to follow me along in the on my handles so make sure to follow me along and uh, I don't see that there's any other, any other issue. Have a good day guys. Yeah, have a good day guys.